and we would like to Venezuela, let's listen some, to some statements. We, are, we have been seeing images of the polling stations and there have been uh, lots of uh, queues in the polling stations of indigenous people in the state of Tamakuro and others, so we, are fe we feel very glad about it. Uh, that we all Venezuelans are fulfilling with the call, uh, complying with the, the call of the Venezuela of Venezuela. We have some information we want to share with you. It's very important. Could you uh, put a, a, a fixed screen? <laughs> right. Well, we have here this information that we have been dis disclosing to all Venezuelans. All Venez Venezuelans who have their IDs out of days can exercise their vote today. So remember that even if the, your IDs are out of day, you can cast your vote, your vote today. Uh, also, Voters you that are seeing, you can vote to uh, any polling station that you, you, you are. So the only candidate is the, the Venezuelan homeland, and you can be dressed uh, um, you can be dressed whatever you, you want. So it is a consultative referendum about a situation that we Venezuelans can sort, uh, want so, to sort out. That our, uh, the dispute about the Esequibo territory in which all Venezuelans are going to participate uh, to reach to a final decision on this uh, issue. So if uh, any Venezuelan can, uh, doesn't know their, their uh, polling sta uh, center, polling station, because, well, if to verify the, where you can vote, you have this number, 20, 2406, there, or number 2637, there uh, you will be, uh, a message will be sent to you to, with the, the polling station you should vote. So, 2406 and 2637, you can just dial that, and there uh, you place your ID, and in 24 seconds, you will get an answer from the system, you, uh, and the location you are going to exercise the vote. So far, so far we have I repeat, for all Venezuelans who heard the, uh, the, the statement, uh, all uh, table, uh, all polling stations uh, members, there are active hundreds, 55,000 uh, 55, officials there from the Amazon to the Huayra and from the Esequibo to, to the Sully State. Everything is working out perfectly thanks to the whole team, thanks to our uh, Bolivarian armed, armed forces. 380,000 uh, officials 
authorities have been guarded the uh, these electoral process from the, uh, all, also the staff from the Ministry of Security to guarantee the safety and, be, uh, and the safety of all Venezuela, Venezuelans. Till uh, the last voter to, for, for them to be able to express their absolute uh, willingness. And we have international guests that are here in today, uh, so we are going to uh, accredit them, and uh, we are going to provide some data for you to disclose So the representatives of cultural, religious organizations that are here today to accompany us in this consultative referendum of, of our dear homeland, Venezuela. Uh, um, let's uh, uh, applaud for the so I, I want to to disclose our affection to them. Uh, Mr. Ambassadors, we have 24 states and federal entities, 335 uh, municipalities, uh, 1,141 uh, parishes, and 15,857 polling stations. So those are the data that um, in each municipality there's been a support for Venezuelan people to vote. So we Venezuelans are very proud of these uh, of the of having the the best electoral system in the world as you have already confirmed uh, from uh, previous uh, electoral events so we manage very well uh, the elections one of one of the five powers that establishes uh, the Venezuelan government, the, the executive power, the legislative power, the judi judi judicial power, um, the citizenship uh, power or popular power, which is uh, through the Republican Council, and the electoral power that is uh, exercised uh, through the uh, National Electoral Council. So, we have distributed uh, uh, polling stations to the states according to, to the states. So each of each of them are working. Ninety-seven percent of them are are working. Uh, the, the, third per, the, the third percent is from those uh, uh, remote polling stations that are going to begin just 
uh, very early to, as well. So the Venezuelan people must know that all, all parties, all political parties and and political um, uh, organizations and movements have been supporting this consultative referendum. 61 political parties and political organizations have been uh, have been attending the electoral uh, council to support this referendum, this ongoing referendum today. All political parties, all Venezuelan political parties are backing uh, this referendum uh, for the homeland of Venezuela besides all national organizations, entrepreneurs, religious ones, cultural ones, uh, sp the sports ones, uh, the communities, the communes, all Venezuelan people, people have been participating to this active referendum that is going on today. It is a, a, an electoral party. We are feeling very proud of Venezuelan people. At, we, we have shown we are united, no matter philosophy, religion, culture, pol pol politics. So all, all Venezuelans are united to defend our Venezuela, Venezuela, the homeland. So we have been expecting this moment for 45 days when the, the electoral program was presented. But today, on December 3rd, we are very satisfied that Everything is working out. So it is just uh, we, we, we expect uh, to complete uh, this referendum very successfully. Even children have been participated in schools, high schools. Generally, we have been doing so in electoral cam campaigns. So, but children and uh, high school students, university students, have have been uh, doing uh, their drill. Mr. Ambassadors, uh, international representatives. There have been a, a drill last week in which all Venezuelan people participated. We are, at this moment, uh, Vice President uh, stood out that 97% of polling stations uh, are working, and uh, we are aware that some information is missing from all other centers that, uh, from, from other stations that are uh, far away from the capital. There have been certain technical problems uh, there, but. Uh, there, there's a picture at, Amaz at the Amazons and Delta Macuro near the Guyana Esequiba, uh, at the Esquibo. There are thousands of indigenous people uh, are defending their homeland, participating in these uh, elections. Uh, participated in in the polling stations of some uh, at some schools uh, and some governors and mayors are just monitoring this process. This is a, a an electoral party 
people are are going to vote very proud and uh, very happy to participate in this process we are living we are experiencing today as i would say uh, like uh, all like public uh, officials uh, and the uh, journalists that have been making an analysis of this, that the, our motivation is just unprecedented. And so I would say to all people of Venezuela, from at their homes, that go, go to vote on December 3rd. You, we Venezuelans uh, are united for the defense of the Esequibo. So these are the data. We are going to continue providing so further data how, how this, this electoral process is going on. Is going on. So, but uh, the whole process is just uh, organized, and so we will be updating you, uh, rectors, leaders are going to vote as well. They're, and well, God bless our dear Venezuela's homeland. All these decisions that we have been disclosing to you, being, being broadcasted, have been approved by the national electoral system by unanimity. The President uh, Carlos Quinteros and Vice President and Rector Hill, President of the Commission and Anne Rogal, and President of the Political Participation Commission and Dr. Leonel Pari and Rector Conrado Perez and, and Rector pa Paula Rosa Hernandez, Dr. and Rector Antonieta Stefano and Rector Ana Julia Quillos and Rector Gustavo Vizcaíno Hill and Rector Fabio Francisco Garcés and Dr. Julio Ramirez and the Secretary, Sec, General Secretary, Secretary of the National of the uh, National Electoral Council. Those are uh, decisions taken uh, by uni unanimity. This is a trustworthy, uh, cutting-edge uh, techno system. Made by the supported by uh, cutting edge technology, and uh, we counted on the active participation of Venezuelans. Uh, thank you very much to all. We are going to accredit our international guests, and thanks for accompanying accompanying us today. So we are going to uh, move across the country, and the international international press is going to to do the same. And thank you very much. And bless you all, and um, and congrats for the Venezuelan people. So, uh, he, and we were listening to the statements of the authority of the National Electoral Council. They said that Venezuela today is united and urged all people to go to the polls with their identification cards, even if they are expired. Moreover, he